Hello everyone, this is Humphrey again with Router Gods, and in this video we're going to go over a practice topology, a very simple two router topology with a couple loopbacks. And all we're going to do is just set it up and set up some IP addresses and ping each other. Nothing too fancy, uh, but this is basically for the guys who are starting out. Uh, you're just learning CCNA stuff, and uh, you, know, you, you probably want to be able to hook up two routers and ping each other before you go into more complicated stuff like RIP or OSPF routing, EIGP, or any of that other stuff. So we've got GNS3 up and running. I'm going to assume that you've watched the other videos and you can get GNS3 uh, up and running. And I'm going to also assume that you have the router images in here. So in this case, we're going with the 2691 images. I've dragged in two routers. Notice they start with router 0 and router 1 at the end there. I'm going to get rid of my node types picture right there. I'm going to zoom in a little bit. I've got my mouse wheel, so I'm going to zoom in just about there. I'm going to add in my interface. The 2691 comes with uh, two Ethernet interfaces already in there, so all I need to do is add the link. I'm going to click on add link right there. Always use manual. Click on manual. Click on the first router. Select F0. Go over to the second router. Click on that. Also select F0. Okay, that's my Ethernet link. I'm going to unclick off of that. I'm going to click on uh, this wonderful icon right here. It's going to add a note. I'm going to add in a loop back over here. This is just text to remind me of uh, what's happening over here. Um, oh, we're going to do 10.0.0.1. Make that a slash 24. Click off of that. And that looks about right. going to add another note over here. going to make that a loop back. Uh, also Got to call it loopback zero. Make that 11. Uh, let's not do that. Let's make it 20.0.0.1 slash 24. Click off of that. I'm going to go back over here to this loopback. I'm going to double click on it. Use the cursor and it's going to be called loopback zero. Okay, we got to give IP addresses to these uh, Ethernet interfaces. So I'm going to give it, uh, let's do 192.168.1.1 over here slash 24 and the text I'm typing in, the numbers I'm typing in, I'm not actually giving the IP addresses now this is just a visual identifier for the topology picture. Okay so that is basically it. I'm gonna save this picture just for my own reference. I'm gonna export this export to my desktop. We'll call it uh, practice Topo zero, save that in there. Okay, and then we'll click no. And as always, verify your stuff. Oh, look at that desktop. Double click on that. Bam, that looks good. Okay, go back to GNS. I'm gonna start up my routers. I'm gonna click that little green start button there. Wait a couple seconds for your hard drive to die down and then click on the console window. It's going to open both my console windows. Notice the title of your console window, if you're using PuTTY, is going to match the title of your router. So here we've got Dynamips R1. That's going to match R1 over there. I'm going to minimize R1 and then we have R0 right here. I'm going to move it to about right there. Wait for the routers to come up. If you don't see this, then that probably means you're using Telnet. And you really shouldn't be using Telnet. And I've got other videos that will show you how to install PuTTY and use it with GNS3. So router is going to come up in just a second. So in our other videos, we covered basic commands to do when you're starting up a new router. We're not going to do that because you can just simply watch the other video. So we're just going to set up the loopback and the Ethernet interface. Do no to that initial configuration. Hit enter. Alright. Go into enable mode, conf t. Do the loopback first. Int loopback 0. IP address. Hit tab. 10 zero, zero. Yeah, we probably should uh, do that logging synchronous command. Ah, forget it. We'll do it later. IP address, hit tab, 10.0.0.1, mask 255.255.255, slash 0, and it's already up. You don't need to do a no shut. 
then we're going to do int fast zero slash zero. That's your fast Ethernet interface. IP address 192.168.1.1.255.255.255.0. No shut. And that's it for router zero. Go over to router one. Move this window oh, about right there. Do no. Enable on there. Conf T. Do the loopback interface first. IP address 20.001.255.255.255.0. Int fast 00. IP address 192.168.1.2. And our slash 24 subnet mask, and remember to do a no shut. Move my window back over here. Do a exit. Exit again. You also could have hit, uh, could have typed in end. We're going to ping the other side of the Ethernet interface. Ping 192.168.1.1. First one's going to fail. All the rest are going to go, uh, going to be successful. And that's basically it. That was it for a simple two-router topology, practice topology zero, IP addresses, and loopbacks. If you can't get it to ping on the other side, you did something wrong, watch the video again and uh, try it over. Thank you very much.